everyone, welcome to the Building Simmer channel. I'm your host, Jesuto Brown. In this video, I'll show you how to build a neighborhood using a 64 by 64 lot. Right now, this lot is going to be built in Windenburg, but you can do this on any lot in any world. It doesn't matter what size it is. I designed this lot to work with the for rent expansion pack, but you don't have to use it. If the only thing you have is the base game, it'll still work. Now what you're seeing are guidelines that I had pre-made so that this video wouldn't be too long. The red lines are for where the platform will go, where the white lines are just the measuring in five space increments of the size of the lots that I'll end up with at the end. You'll see where when I place the platform, all of the lines where the fences are will disappear. Generally speaking, the uh, measurements for the sidewalks will be two spaces, while the road will be seven spaces. At this point, I used the grass flooring to cover where the lots are going to go, and then I used the flooring from the masonry section to complete the roadways. Here you'll see where I used the foot illumination system to make the road markings, including the sidewalk and to divide the lanes for the cars that you can find in the debug um, area, which we'll get to later. One detail that I like to add into my neighborhoods is to add a little bit of color to the sidewalk. It gives it a unique look and easier to see and when I go to decorate with the, the bug menu, it just makes it easier to place items for me.
Okay, so the platforms are built, the roadways are made, and it's time to decorate. If you don't have Twisted Mexi's Better Build Buy Mod, uh, I highly recommend you install it. But if you don't want to use mods, you can always use the cheats. You press Ctrl, Shift, and C to bring up your console. Use the testing cheats, the move objects, and hidden items cheats in order to uh, reveal everything that you're going to need. Next thing, you go to your search bar and you type in debug, and that will bring up everything. If you don't type in debug, it won't work. there's one thing left to do and that's to give a good look at the neighborhood one thing I did notice as I was setting it up for uh, for rent now I'm pretty sure if you download this and you don't have for rent it will still work it's just you know it won't have the individual lots but as I was placing the for rent like sections it dropped the platform to the ground so I had to go back and re-raise the platform that was the only thing that I found that was uh, kind of messed up. Other than that, it looks pretty good. I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, all those things and all the social medias. And this neighborhood will be on the gallery. So I'll see you guys next time. And bye.